What is up everybody? I'm making this quick video today to share with you a very helpful tip for mindfulness meditation. So uh, most of you who have been following me for a while now know that I'm a big fan of mindfulness meditation. It has helped me a lot with uh, a lot of issues, you know, with the depression, with anxiety and all those uh, kind of negative emotions. And uh, mindfulness meditation is something I generally do on a daily basis. So the tip I want to share with you today is learning to stop verbalizing your thoughts. So if you have like hit a plateau with your mindfulness meditation uh, progress, if you can call it that, uh, it's uh, a very helpful way to improve your to clear your head, you know, to clear your mind is to try to stop verbalizing your thoughts. Now, although this might sound a bit unnatural, if you think about it, verbalizing your thoughts is what is unnatural because it is something that didn't really exist, you know, ever since man started walking on earth. It's actually something artificial. Language is something artificial, which just evolved as you know as we humans evolved in order to communicate with each other so even though this was something we started doing in order to communicate with people nowadays it has become something so automatic that we uh, instantly verbalize every experience you know every thought everything we do we instantly most of us at least verbalize it in our heads so Trying to stop this while you're doing mindfulness meditation can help a lot with, you know, uh, clearing your mind. So what you just have to do is just let your thoughts be, you know, let those, let the images in your head, the, either that's people uh, or whatever, let them be, but don't verbalize them, you know, just observe them. So remember that meditation is not about like uh, squeezing your brain muscle into stopping to think. Uh, it's more of observe, just observing your thoughts, observing your mind's process and letting it calm by itself. Of course, there is some uh, discipline required. For example, you know, you just, you cannot just uh, let your mind loose, but it's more like floating on water you know so if you want to float on water if you like flap your hands too much if you kick too much you're just gonna drain yourself and you will sink in the end mindfulness meditation is just you know giving the less amount of movement in order to float out of your mind, out of your thoughts. So I hope this video was helpful to you. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Like the video, share it on Facebook, share the love. I recently wrote an ebook, my new official ebook, which I talk all about this in the part one, you know, all about how meditation helped me uh, go through my, li my life's problems and all of that. You can download part one for free if you click on this link. So go check it out if you want and until next time, keep on training.